Gobet. <laughs> Mick said do it a bit more flashy. Flashy? Yeah, flashy. What's flashy? Hey guys, Riley here. Today we are taking a look at the QBot P11. So let's get up close to the phone. To kick things off, it has a 2200 mAh battery and 8GB storage, which is average, but luckily you can expand the storage to 32GB using a micro SD. It runs Android Lollipop 5.1 and has a standard micro USB port for charging at the bottom. Moving along the side, there is a power button close to the volume rocker, which can be a pain, but is not much of a hassle. It does not weigh too much, but has a five inch IPS screen, which is great for watching video and daily use. The back is removable, which may be a good thing. However, it has got a really cool design using triangles, which I personally really like and feels great in the hand. It opens us at it opens us at it opens up smoothly and without lag or delay, which in my case is very useful when I am trying to check apps like Instagram or Snapchat. I found the phone on Amazon for sixty four ninety nine, and but you can pick one up on eBay for fifty nine ninety nine. There is a two megapixel front facing camera that can be five megapixels and an eight megapixel round back which can be changed to 13 megapixels. There are three colours to choose from, gold, white and in our case, black. I have just got this phone today and as my keyboard X15 stopped working and so far I am happy with it. Thanks guys for watching today's tutorial. If you... Tutorial? It's even a tutorial. <laughs> So guys, thanks for watching today's review of the QBot P11. Uh, as you might have saw in the last video, we are doing weekly videos on this channel. So, so far we're up, up to scratch, aren't we? Yes, we are. So, watch out for a video next week. We might do double uploads in a week, but don't get your hopes up because there probably won't be. But uh, next video is probably going to be a comparison of this phone which we have just reviewed now, the QBot P11 versus this one, which was a light, the Huawei Y625, which is my phone, which is the QBot P11, and Ali's phone, who is the cameraman, uh, his Huawei Y625. So we're gonna compare them, see which one's better, in our opinions anyway. And yeah, so that's gonna be the next video, but thank you guys for watching this review. I will see you later.